Big game for South Oak Cliff High School tonight, and this is the goal, right? A repeat of last year, and if they can get that big W tonight at AT&T Stadium, they'll be the first Dallas ISD school to win back-to-back -back state titles, so cross your fingers. Now, I mentioned they won last year, right? Well, they were the first DISD school to win a state football title in over 60 years, and when you do that, you throw yourself a parade, right? Well, I was there last year for this. It was incredible. The energy, the pride, the happiness, it was awesome making history there. So of course the goal tonight, right? Win and then throw yourself another parade. And let me tell you this, the community and the players, they're here for it. And we're going to get this W for the city of Dallas. You know, by winning state last year, we want to do this repeat this year. They weren't expecting us to win the first time. So the second time is like, we'd be immortal. We was legends the first time. Now we're going to be immortal when we win the second one. So again, kickoff tonight, 7 p.m. AT&T Stadium taking on Port Nietzsche's Groves. And take a look at this tweet here from Dallas ISD Athletics. Let's set the UIL state attendance record. Hashtag Operation 60,000 encouraging everybody to wear black tonight at AT&T Stadium. Good luck, boys. Now, they're not the only ones who have big state championship games on today. Check it out. We've got all the information over on our website, WFA.com. DeSoto, Duncanville, Alito, they've all got big games tomorrow. And if you missed it, Gunter beat Poth in the 3A D2 championship, their third. So let's hope even more North Texas teams can bring home the trophy. I'll send it back to you.